This is my MPT alternate build for set number 30680, the AAT poly bag. This alternate build is very fragile, but looks really cool. So let's get into it. Now, this alternate build is based off of the Phantom Menace version of this vehicle. I know that this isn't really the same color, but the ones from the Clone Wars are blue, and this is definitely not that. I also am more of a fan of the version from the Phantom Menace, so that's why this looks like this. But anyway, this build has a lot of slope pieces because the AAT has a lot of slope pieces in it, as you can see by this picture. But this build uses almost all all of them. I actually think the only leftover piece is one of these flat pieces. It's kind of crazy. My favorite part of this build is definitely the front where I was able to use this circular piece for the little door and I was also able to use these spiked pieces as those rails in the front. I also used the base piece of the AAT for the sides. I did a lot of greebling on the side. As you can see there's a bunch of random shapes. There is still some more of those slanty pieces but I added this dark gray piece with the gun on the side just to kind of represent some pipes or something. The back of the vehicle has a totally different color of brown and this color is way more similar to the one actually seen in the movies. There's also some gray pipes in the back. I know these look kind of strange, but these are actually here for a very important reason, and that is the top comes off. So this top piece is not connected by any studs. It's just loose, and you can kind of see how it's designed. It's pretty fragile. Not a lot of the pieces are put together very well, but that's just because of the limitations you have to deal with when making an alternate build. But anyway, you just clamp this onto the top, and then you squeeze this together, and then it actually won't fall off when you tilt it upside down. I don't really know how this works. It's just friction, I guess. And it'll only really fall off if you like drop it or something. The bottom of the build is a little tiled off. I was going to put some of the flat pieces on the bottom, but it kind of made it tip off to one side. So I just like the way this works and you can still slide it on stuff. But yeah, overall, this alternate build is pretty good. Just very fragile. You won't be able to put any battle droids in it. Obviously, it is definitely not to scale, but it still looks really cool on display. So there you have it, guys. That's my Lego Star Wars MTT alternate build for set number 30680, the AAT poly bag. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.